Hey Scorpio, welcome into the channel. Good morning. I hope you guys are having a good day so far. Good afternoon. Good evening. Whatever time it is that you are watching this. Okay, Scorpio, immediately I get justice. Okay, justice for you. All right. Um, there's a lot that's coming forward. Prosperity. Okay. There's a lot of change. Um, if you got the or watch the first little snippet of your reading, um, I'm going to title it probably the same as this. It'll be part one. Um, a lot came through. Okay. That was just me getting prepared for the reading. Um, but you guys, what I see is there's a lot of change, Scorpio, that you need to be ready for. Get on, like, get prepared for, um, get your mind, your heart, your soul, your spirit, get your body, get everything ready for these changes, okay? Someone's going to be, I promise you, someone's going to be finding out they're pregnant, okay? Um, if not, then you're going to be, like, someone's getting, it's like this. Someone's going to be finding out they're pregnant. Another of you guys is getting engaged, okay? Um, it could be simultaneously that these events occur. Um, there's a level of surprise, okay? The other thing that I'm getting for you, Scorpio, um, is that, yeah, cosmic flower. Something's going to be blooming in your life. This could be a new job, entrepreneurial event that you're going to be um, deciding to take action on. Maybe Source is giving you a grand idea, okay? Something uh, different, okay, for you to venture after. You're going to be doing this. Be unafraid. I'm seeing the full energy for you. Like, get on out there, okay? Um, scared money don't make no money. It's time for you to bust a move, okay? Now, the other energy that I got in the premeditation for you is Bobcat Spirit and the Dove. The Bobcat speaks about life being a mystery, and the Dove speaks about peace. Be peace, okay? So I feel between the two of those sources asking you, no matter what's going on right now, you might not be able to see your way all the way through or see what's coming in towards you. Still continue to be in a peaceful state, a positive state, okay? Um, you guys, there are a fly, there's a flower two or three in my house right now, okay? Um, so you maybe could have received some, some heartbreaking news, okay? Um, or something just kind of that you've gotten over your healing from, okay? Um, the flies are in here, y'all, because I barbecued yesterday, all right? And I had my door open, yay. And I, I can't kill them. I can't bring my soul to kill them. So I'm like, they just, my, either my cat's gonna get them or, you know, yeah, just being in here with me closed up in this space and I'm not feeding them, so I don't know what they eating, okay? But uh, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, they'll get up out of here, okay? I'm hoping I can just shoe fly away. Maybe I had to tell someone, you know, shoe fly, don't bother me, okay? You had to get really grounded, all right? You had to tell someone or show someone or reveal to someone who or what you desired, okay? I feel like you had to explain your truth to someone. You had to stand firm on something. You had to... Um, Hold your ground is the energy that I am getting, okay, with the root chakra. Excuse me, background noise you are hearing, okay? Because I don't know what that's about. But anyway, there's also an energy here of source asking you to um, return to a childlike energy. Check on your inner child. Do some self-reflecting. Get really grounded. Red could be a really important color for you at this time. You could have had a really um, fiery experience. Yeah, look, magic with someone, okay? Um, someone could have tried to bring you some form of magic all right some form of voodoo all right someone could have tried to enter your orc energy or your astral field or your um someone could have tried to battle you in the spiritual realm okay and the way that you handled it is that you your magic is different from you know the witchery or the i'm gonna say the black magic um voodoo in a negative you know because voodoo is not all that stuff y'all is to be proceed however you want to i'm not trying to get off into that so what i am going to say is that for from what i know to be true in my my space is what i'm going to share with you someone tried to come up against you scorpio okay and you show them your power um you could be a you could have fire in your chart this person could have been a fire sign um you could be a cross watcher in here watching this okay and you're just wanting to figure out what changes are coming in your way or what has what changes has occurred basically you stood your ground on something whatever that is in your life 
you reflected your magic, your black girl magic, your white girl magic, your Mexican girl magic, your magic, whatever that is, or black guy magic, your, your Mexican guy magic, your white guy magic, your Chinese magic, okay? Whatever it was, you reflected that. Your power, your strength, just your spirituality. It's like you had to flex. And when you flexed on someone, they got the point, okay? Coherence. They understood what it was, okay? They saw something. They saw the truth, okay? They saw the truth. They saw the truth about what needs to be healed in their life and coming in your direction, Scorpio. I feel like you're a very magical being. What was that? Yeah, transition, okay? You could have changed this person's view, perspective, okay? You could have been changing. I'm hearing their domain, all right? Maybe someone has to relocate. They know that they can't use you. They can't feed off of your energy anymore. They cannot manipulate you. They cannot trick you. They cannot deceive you because you get your magic straight from source, okay? You get your power, your divinity. You get it straight from source. Look, transition came back out. So you did. You transitioned this person. And them coming in, that's the energy of you, Scorpio. I'm also seeing a genie in a bottle, okay? Maybe now you have a genie, okay, that's going to be granting you some form of a wish. I feel like maybe you have a guardian angel watching over you. You have angels or divine beings that are going to be granting you some form of a wish. But the other thing I was getting from this energy is you. I'm seeing a Scorpio here. I'm seeing the scorpion, okay? I'm seeing that people can come into a Scorpio's energy, and get it all the way effed up or twisted, right? Okay. And what you end up doing because of who you are is you transmute the energy. And I feel like that's what someone saw you do. Someone saw you transmute some darkness that they tried to send you away. You did it right before their eyes. I don't know if somebody was trying to maybe, um, yeah, I was just going to say somebody could have been trying to talk, speak over you, talk to you or handle you wrong. Someone could have been um, speaking death over you, okay? They could have gave you some form of a book or some form of, um, some type of information, okay? But the information they gave you, they thought it was going to destroy you. Whatever the words that they spoke over you, they thought it was going to belittle you, bring you down or break you. But you actually took the magic that they were trying to send you away. You transformed it, okay? Because magic can also be in the form of people speaking ill will over you, people speaking death upon your, um, your creative endeavors. So if you have a channel or if you have a business, you own a business like I do, okay? Um, or if you you just are a spiritual person and you just know that your energy is vibrating so high that you heal or transform energy or transmute it. And I feel like someone came in and they didn't know that you had that ability. They thought that they could bring you something that was going to tear you down. They thought that they could speak maybe ill will to a manager about you and get you fired. They thought that they could come in and uh, manipulate you in some type of way and you wouldn't catch on to a trick that they were trying to um, put in the mix. Like I get a five of wands energy, a five of swords energy. Someone was trying to backstab or betray you in some type of way. But in all essence, they came in. They got exactly what they were looking for, didn't they, Scorpio? <laughs> they got the truth, the light, all right? They got that realness. They got the stinger that's on the other end of the scorpion. You feel me? The stinger that comes up, that sits above you. They don't see that. They just see you here at ground level. They see you, but they don't see what's underneath, okay? They didn't see what was hidden, and they didn't see what was right in front of them either so i think that you transition them and maybe the way that they are going to communicate with you in the future like you show someone like i'm not no pushover <laughs> um i'm not to be disrespected okay and i'm well 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 protected all right this could have been a lover okay but now also scorpio you showed them love you showed them love you showed them true love universal love romantic love someone got turned on by what you did like you could have talked you could have really went laid in on someone but respectfully and humbly i'm talking about really gave it to them right scorpio but they they couldn't do anything but be like damn like i admire her like dang i wouldn't fool with her like you tripping like dang they could have even told a lover of yours like 
you're you really messed up with that person right there like that's a powerful being that woman right there knows her worth that man right there knows his value okay it's like something like that where you outshined even them like you shocked the heck out of someone by what you did yeah cosmic flower okay they saw they saw they saw your, your blossoming they saw they saw that you are a cosmic flower a cosmic flower yeah coherence they they got the message a cosmic flower is you in rare form on astral showing your true colors whatever they are the blossoming of you Something about a dog could be very, very specific or significant in this reading, okay? I don't know if you have a dog. I'm hearing training wheels, okay? Um, yeah, training wheels, okay? So we have healing coming out, okay? Four of swords. I feel like someone needs to focus. You showed someone they need to focus on their healing. You showed someone they are not where they should be on their path, in their position, in the relationship, in the friendship, in the community. You could have showed someone in the community that they were not as healed as they were leading on or putting out, okay? Cosmic flower. Yeah, you, you flexed on somebody, Scorpio. So there's um, the energy of a spicy girl wind. And I feel like a fire sign, okay, or someone with fire, Scorpio. I feel like you got a lot of fire in your chart, possibly. You've won. Yeah, compassion, allowance, and perception, okay? You want abundance, justice, okay? The cycle of abundance and justice is what's coming due to you. It's returning to you because all I'm seeing here is this 15, which breaks down to a six on this compassion card, okay? Sixes represents harmony, balance, justice, okay? Even love, all right? Then you have here allowance, Okay, a nine. Okay, that's a cycle. Nines are cycles. So I feel like this is a new cycle that's coming in for you. Perception, you're about to see that you've transformed a situation. You've overcome an obstacle. Okay, you superseded in some area of your life. All right. And so perception with this eight and abundance, things are about to start to open up for you. Things are about to start to shift and move and change in your life. You're going to start to see evidence of this in this reality. OK. And this dimension in the here and now is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing pleasantries. OK. I'm hearing awards. I'm hearing money. Tantric journey. Angel number 42. And then we're back to the cosmic flower. OK. And this is all because you remembered who you were. OK, you spoke up for yourself. All right. I feel like you represented yourself well. Someone could have been trying to speak dirt on your name. OK, but they really found out they need to watch how they speak on your name. OK, truth be told is what I'm hearing. OK, someone now they remember they see. I'm hearing someone stands corrected. OK, Scorpio. Um. They stand corrected. Yeah, Markova. Okay. You have also um, gained a new level of stability, Scorpio. Okay. Four of Wands energy. Someone could be proposing to you. Um, like I said, I may have said that earlier. Okay. Um, this is going to make you very happy because it's going to end. Um, I feel like a, a cycle of you being out in the cold or being abandoned or feeling alone. Okay. So we now have synergy. Yeah, there's a lot of changes your way coming your way. There's a lot of um, Pisces energy here. I'm getting Pisces off of this card. There's some changes coming as far as if you're any type of healer, okay? Um, there's a lot of changes coming. Discernment, okay? Um, there's a changes coming to a partnership. But there's changes coming to the way that you alchemize, the way that you are manifesting, okay? Um yeah, there's something you're aligned with now. You're aligning with a new path here, Scorpio. Okay, get ready for this. Yeah, divine feminine energy and miracle. Y'all don't mind my cards, my cat. I don't know. I'm going to have to get her, y'all. She's starting to bite on my cards, but I left him on the ground, on my box, but I didn't think she was going to get him. But anyway, yeah, you've seen some form of a change here. Third eye, source is going to show you. If you haven't seen this change that's going to occur, um, source is going to reveal 
something to you very soon, either about a divine feminine or you could be the divine feminine. The source is going to reveal something to you, okay? Um, this is going to make you happy because it's bringing an end to some sort of uh, darkness, okay? Continue to listen to your intuition. Continue to work your jelly. Whatever your jelly is, whatever your black girl magic, your white girl magic, whatever your magic is, okay? Whatever that is, your Chinese girl magic, whatever it is, Asian magic, Latino, whatever, okay? German, whoever's in here. Y'all work your magic because it's working for you. People are seeing the real you, okay? They're getting, maybe someone had a, a mess that I'm telling you, it's like someone tried to put a bug in someone's ear about you. Someone tried to speak ill about who you were or what you represent. And they really found out like, dang, that person, I was wrong. Dang, I shouldn't have believed what, what, what Joe said. You know what I'm saying? I should have listened, listened to myself all along or I should have listened to... um you know, whatever. I shouldn't have listened to anyone else. I should have gone by, you know, my intuition. I should have got a feel for this person's character. Like someone is feeling like that. Like I should have, I should have, I shouldn't have listened to you. I should have just filled this person out myself because this person, Scorpio, they turned out to be an awesome person. Like they turned out to have great character. Like somebody is readjusting how they feel about you, Scorpio, how they view you or how they have experienced you. Okay, and it's all because you didn't shy away, you didn't cower away, you stood your ground, you showed them who you truly were, but you stayed humble, you stayed Libra energy, you stayed balanced out with that thing. Okay, I'm seeing the scales of balance card out of the ISIS deck. So, congratulations, Scorpio. Um, spicy girl win. I feel like there's some fire, whatever that fire was on that stinger you got, Scorpio. Like, yeah, you won that. All right, anyway, I hope you had a good um reading. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, you all. Thank you all for your love and your support, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.